So who gives you the right? Okay, mm, I was I, just... <laughs> this is... A... And I was Kim Cattrall. Ooh. A fine diagnosis. Okay, thing I want to talk about... There are just some things you will never... You're not a vampire. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Mm. When is his birthday? Poor creatures only live for like... Hey, folks, my name is... No, tonight, giz... Fuck off, just get us anything so it looks like we're eating. Oh. Good glamour, do you want to come up and join us? <laughs> no, I hate you and I want to die. When I was running the Vampire Nightclub, I may have got a little bit too much into the old uh, liquor blood. <laughs> and then one night, I got so shit off my face that I sat on my dolly and I minced her legs with my wagon. Don't be such a Debbie Downer. Come and join in the human b I've done to my legs is unforgivable. You can be the queen of the restaurant, eh? Push the button, my darling. Don't you dare press the button on my toe. Oh, come on, it's so fun. Good. Whoa, kick a boo, queen so of good. Oh, what have I done? You know what you did. You're never going to forgive me, oh. Mouse. I thought you were Osava. What is on your mind? This. It's nothing, I just... I can't get something out of my mind of that little pip scoop. There's something right. that, uh, Time. oh, he could get his old job at... <laughs> 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 Come on, fly around, I joke. That's <laughs> made my <laughs> night. That's the joke <laughs> when we imagine oh. that you have become a vampire. Imagine Graham as a vampire. <laughs> <laughs> you <mixed. laughs> What do you mean? What if I put that in class? <laughs> 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 Going to a vampire who is not his master. Now, I am a fan of edgy comedy, but that is no laughing matter. Be talking about any of this out loud. It, it's OK, I just... What you're talking about is the greatest humiliation a familiar could bestow upon his master. Well, it was a nice dinner, so you have had a happy birthday to distract you from the fact you will soon die. You're welcome. Here, here, well said. And for your birthday wish, we all promised to do a much better job of blending in as you requested. I guess I'll see you back at the house. Ooh. What is mall? OK, this is the mall. Yes, yes. Hey, we okay. understand. Great. I'll be right back. Will it work? Yes, of course it will work. We are going to fix this, and this is how we do it. I am looking for the exact proportions of Venus herself when her pussy was serving butcher's tea and a taint that can sign its own checks. Oh, yes! Rainbow sombrero, for sure! <laughs> <laughs> what is wrong now? Enixero, you didn't even ask for my opinion? What the hell are you talking about? Did you not hear what I said about the taint? You think something is going very tits up with my life? Oh, no, Colin Robinson! How about my nightclub got destroyed by fire? Wait. Drinking liquor blood every day for months. I know, my. None of you told me to slow down. Poor, precious little Dolly has got her body all mingled and minced up. You did that by sitting on me. I'm going to end the evening. And I have just a thing. What was it then? It's not really conducive to pause it. Were you gone? Yes. I have been. After a while, I just. just... <laughs> what did I miss? What's the old gang been up to, eh? Oh, no, what happened to your little body? She sat on me. No, they've never invited me to live in that. Spark of shit things that keep happening to me. I've got no one to talk to about it. I am here. Yes, yes, but you know what I mean. Got absolutely no really close female friends anymore. None? Nope. Go figure. So you're telling me? You have no close female friends? None at all. Uh, all right. For what? All these... Tr I hate to say it, but I think it might be... mean, like a curse? No, no. Curses are hexes, on the other hand. Elections. Right. Let's just... Is there any... Nope. No. No? No, but... Nope. Am I needed for this bit, or can I just take a nap while you do your sh**? This is way. I'm listening. Right here. Oh, is this yours? But... No, I know this woman. This is a very bad luck woman. A re How did this get here? <laughs> that ought to do it. <clears throat> what? Shriveled bitch! Now that really ought to do it. <laughs> Icky. <laughs> This is a little bit really bad, isn't it? 
I am hexed, which is not great. But I haven't read the anti paxan language in hundreds of years, so... Simons, Gary Simons, Gary Simons. I am a little bit rusty. <laughs> Could you maybe help translate this picture using your gray box? Sure. So I had to get Colin Robinson to help me translate on his computer machine. And he told me something which, quite frankly, blew my mind apart. Which, which there is a little anti paxos what? Oh, yeah, You're just above little Italy. A broad mosaic. No, no, shut up. Are you saying there is a little anti paxos right here on Staten Island? <laughs> Kalinikta! So much cheap crap and old fish. It's like looking out the window of my childhood home. A neighborhood known as Little Antipaxos. Yes, it is where all the Antipaxans who come to America work and live and laugh and love. I'm Nacha. A beast of those. Three for joy. Look, this is the beach of Motomi. I tried to lose my virginity here so many times. The food of my youth. Of course, the Greeks stole it from us and claimed it as their own, but the real heads know that it originally came from Antipaxos, ne? It would be wrong not to just try a little bit. <laughs> so worth it. You can still sell that, I think. <laughs> Thank you. Hey. Oh, this place. Thought to tell me there was a little Antipaxos neighborhood like half a mile from our house? Bali or Hidi! Shitty diner, just like my Thea used to run. Come on. <laughs> it is an anti paxon thing. No me oti me lame a thin polytypical safiti hora. She says it says a simple act of kindness, compassion, and friendship is that is on top of your head. Now, this is a new me. Kind, welcoming, inclusive, sensitive to the feelings of others. Yes, yes. Oh, it's very complicated. I, I don't think you can understand. <laughs> what the fuck is that? I'm really proud of my campaign platform. <sighs> yeah. We consider you guys heroes for that. See. <laughs> okay. The loss of my dolly body has got me thinking about my old human body. I never got to experience... What? Oh, I think what she means is... How can you be a virgin? Your spirit is identical to my own, and I am definitely not a virgin. I'm a vampire. Jonas the mule dancer. Strictly hand stuff. If there was anything, anything I could do about this, I would. But sadly, I just, I don't. Well, what if we swap? What a cute little idea, but unfortunately, that is definitely not possible. Oh, no. Is it? Well, great! 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 Okay! Oh, great. That is just great. Well, great. And thus, we are technically able to... And that's really how it works. My dolly is going to inhabit my body to use it to get completely and utterly railed. Yes, please. And then we will switch back. <sighs> okay. Daimus teamus nocti onirate mugakti makogi... Us and Taki Day! Fresh beef salad. It's time to be with anyone in this house. This Wait for me, Gugamu! I'm doing it! I'm a real body person! Right, we swapped bodies. Mm. None of you find this interesting. Hello? Not really. I mean, you're kind of the same. Uh, what about the one? That if you throw a vampire's shoe into the river, you have to follow it. Oh, yes, true. Hello, everyone. I'm a virgin. I used to be dead, and then I was a ghost, and then I was a doll, and now I am human once more. <laughs> How about you? Mud huts or livestock? I like him. Really cheap. Just one large goose, and before you can even slit its throat, I'm your wife. Ugh. How do you feel about taking the virginity of a dead ghost? It's your lucky night. Ugh. Woo! <laughs> Whoopa! Hello! This is a mating dance because I have selected you to be my maid. Oh. Look how wide I am. Right. Please, no physical right. touch. Fuck off, lady! Oh. Okay, all what? right, you are out of here. Come on. What? No, I was just doing it. 
Yes, thank you. Remove us. Come on. Oh. There is one person in the house the doll is horny for. I don't like this decision, but since we all F each other all the time here anyway, I can't be a hypocrite, right? Nope. Nadja's body wants to have... Uh-huh. Yep. And real Nadja, who's... Mm-hmm. And... No! I'm open. We don't really like you that much. I, I wouldn't say we are friends. No. Okay. Oh. Hey, zero. <laughs> this guy does not understand oh, women at all. Yeah. Hey, grey boy, I'm offering it to you on a plate. Music to get us in the mood. Mm. Woo! Oh, yeah. Comes in. Oh. Oh, it's... I, I can't. Oh. I like how fuss is. I just, I think I'm only. I get that. Daddy likey with daddy likey. But I have barely got them to do anything. I haven't even used this yet. I'm not going anywhere. I just sassy leaving dance. No, oh, bitch. No. Come back. Yeah, there's no way. Look at that. I guess it works. <gasps> I know what you're trying to do. Come out, you tricksy little bitch as well. Eat scadampany. Oh, I think I'm going to go just read my newspaper. No, I want to go practice cartwheels. No, I want to go finish my blog about being a male feminist. <laughs> Point wrong. So much for coming. Yeah. 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 Whoa. <laughs> Robinson. Holy shit. No, be gay. My turn again. What the fuck is <laughs> Who's ready for a parade? Oh, I'm looking. <laughs> no, I'm dancing. <laughs> we're proud. We're so proud. Oh! Oh! oh, oh, oh. Gather around, everyone. Oh, yes. Nope. Nope. Only asking us what we're doing so you can tell us what you're doing. We don't care. Really? My new friend. Oh, the little anti Paxos. I have been spending my nights with a delightful family. No, I, I have I like eaten. Being with them makes me feel almost human. I've been helping my new family by actually working, and maybe these simple acts of kindness, compassion, and friendship might help lift this pissing anti paxon curse that I have all over me. But they keep asking to meet Laszlo. Laszlo is not from anti paxos and anti paxons are very, very suspicious of outsiders. He's coming tonight. Island thing. What the fuck are you wearing? I'm dressed as an islander. These people are peasants. It's important I fit in, my darling. Their way of speaking. Me, Laszlo. He's the matriarch of this very important family to me. Okay? Yes? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. He was dropped on his head as a baby. A chosas. Enjoy. <laughs> Hello, my. <laughs> the memory of a song when. Scott Tors, who anti packed Tors. Scott Tors, who anti packed my sweet love, Laszlo, consulted me before just putting on a big concert in front of my new family. Don't sing the battle hymn of our neighboring island, Nisida Mongonisi, because that place is the home of our mortal enemies. <laughs> Shut up! You were know. singing, kill them, kill them, kill them. How many times have I said that to you in Greek? Well, it's a good question. I am an esteemed British gentleman, well-bred to the man of born. I can play any instrument. I can fashion any tree if I've gone at ear to cut this. Oh, for fuck's sake, Laszlo. <laughs> <They're doing laughs> <this. laughs> my new family absolutely bloody love Laszlo. There is a tale in my country that has been passed down through generations of a wet headed, wide bodied, ignorant oaf with the brains of a chewing gum. The spirit is said to continually reincarnate itself, but always as a pompous, perverted oaf. And my family think it is well. <laughs> Laszlo! Hello, how are you? Vasileas Hurignon, the king of pigs. My king of pigs. Yeah. <laughs> very, very, very <laughs> Turn on the television. Your arm's broken? Please! Uh, that is not neat! OK, Nando, don't get your knickers in a twist. I accidentally told this Joanna Roth. All of the views of... Oh, all of the humans are going to drive us out of Staten Island like they drove us out of the old gun! Game over! Oh. No. Oh. Oh. What? Joanna Ruska, do you have any better ideas? Look out! Oh. Look out! Oh. Oh, fuck this. Ah! Medical analysis, I've decided that it is not a good idea. Colin Robinson now is not the time for decorating. Get your fucking go bag! Vampires must always be prepared to skip out of town at a moment's notice. I have been chased out of five, maybe six villages over the course of my vampiric life, and believe me, you don't want to be caught out there fleeing with only the clothes on your back. Sleeping at the bottom of a cold well, sucking on the throats of the mountain gods you once call your brothers? No! 
So what was the first thing I did when I moved to Staten Island? I made the go bags. I have decided on a multi-part plan, the first part of which... How is that going to help? In your go bags, you will find your emergency fleeing checklist. Ancestral soils. Check. Three days supply of blood. Uh, oof, little bit rank, but check. Memorize new identity. <clears throat> oh, hello. My name is Sally Rhubarb. I am a blonde girl from a large farm, and my blackberry pie wins every year at the county fair. Don't sit there! Why not? <gasps> For our final stand. Oh, yes, because the attackers' first thing they will do is come down and take a nice rest. I think you're all wasting valuable time. Thank you. What you need to do... No, you need to get your gold bag. Ah. Get your gold bag. Trust the plan. Get your gold bag. Trust! Yeah, hey, you two may want to have your argument away from the chandelier fall zone. Also, mind the tripwire. Fucking hell. Places, places. It's all right, it's all right, my darling. Damn. Would you stop fucking saying that, Claire Robinson? And no, you did not hypnotize anyone, Nando. Those television humans interrupted your bladder with a warning of a... Also, why is your hair yellow, Nadja? I am not Nadja. Oh. I am Sally Rhubarb. Diplomacy did not work, so let us do it. Let us flee. Us? Yes. Um, OK, C cool. <laughs> I shall go prepare my disguise. But it would add time. Is anybody listening to me? You need to get your go bags! So this is it, then. This is really goodbye, my Akabi Moo. I'm afraid so, my Matty Moo. I must see my plan through. It has many steps. Ready? Oh. oh, so when the villagers who are chasing us say they're looking for a blonde and a brunette? Well, I guess I didn't really think it through. Friends, us, Joanna, they may outnumber us. They may have a satellite truck and a... The a it. Mm. Look at us, running around this way and that. We all have a part to play in this, and play it we must, but... Yeah, yeah. Thank you, look on with it. Yes, this is all your fault, you know. Boom. And 30 years from now, it's... and you have a little ghost dolly on your knee, and she looks up at you, and she says, <laughs> maybe you won't need to say to her... I would never do... You guys, I'm back. I have a plan. Oh, really I don't have time to tell you everything that you've missed. Right, up. Fucking idiot! Don't leave, they get it on the memory card. Do not stop! What is going on? Are they flying? Don't leave, they got on my side. Okay, call the station and tell them that we're coming in with the footage. Follow that tape! Second part of the plan. In. Oh, it's the same plan, Pat! So, Lisa Lipton and Ted Spinelli get hypnotized. We're going to unhypnotize them too? Yes, good idea. To all of the viewers of the Channel 8 News, you will remember nothing out of the ordinary tonight. Should we just leave now? That will look very suspicious to the humans that have just tuned in. Just read the words on the screen. Uh... Hip hip pop ray! Indeed. It is time again for Staten Island's annual puppy parade. Which is always a barking good time. Here's hoping we have some nice weather for these promenading poaches. <laughs> and now let's turn it over to Colin Robinson with the weather. Um, well, that's a, a little... Our four-legged friends will certainly be happy to hear that. Raring to go for Sunday's game against the Cowboys. Thank you, my love. Well, that is it for us tonight, New York. And from everyone at Channel 8 News... Goodbye. Goodbye. Bye, then. That's it. Just Try and look normal. Mm. Oh. Ah, seriously, Nadja, I don't need urgent care. I can just sleep it off. Do you really think I want to be doing this? If it was up to me, I would have just packed your ankle in some muck made from fish piss and fed you some pickled pig's ears. But no, my husband thinks the doctor is better. Trust the science, my darling. I don't know what's going on with my body right now, but if a doctor finds out that I'm almost a vampire, I'm a dead man. And if Naja finds out, it'll be even worse. So... Stop squirming, Guillermo. We're very close now. No, you know what? I feel a lot better. The vampire doctor is going to fix your mingled foot. What? You said we were going to urgent care. Yes. Familiar urgent care, no. silly. No, no, Naja, no! I don't know. Why are we, why are we going here? Oh! This is for better. I'm not a dog. Shh. Potato, potato. Um, yes, hello. Um, I've got a broken familiar. So you don't want to go around that corner? Yeah, I've been here before. There is nothing to see here. It is just a dover 
Spider-Man with a floppy tail. Hold on tight. Wait, where are we going? Uh, through the wall. No, no, stop. That's a solid wall. No, 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 no. Ah, okay. That was kind of common cold, so there's going to be sneezing and coughing, and that is going to be oh, a burden no, on you. Not. So I have a recommendation, and that is put her down. Oh, gosh. You really think so? Even if she recovers from this cold, she's, good God, she's like almost 40. She might squeeze out a few more good years, but we're talking quality of life. Okay. Let's do it. No, fuck okay. this. I'm out of here. Oh, come down. You're going to be okay. No! It's a live one. <laughs> Thanks, guys. It's a dating check. No! Fantastic. That's it. Aww. Sweet dreams, Guillermo. Yeah, <laughs> perfect. Well, again, sorry for your loss. <laughs> she was just a familiar, but thank you. It is kind of nice to think of Kathy on that rainbow bridge doing stuff with her familiar friends. Having spaghetti or whatever it is they dream of doing. Well, they're in a better place now. Yes. I wish I was. All right, I'm looking for a nudge. Oh, yes, please. Can we go? Well, Guillermo's ankle is healing up nicely, which oh. is very unusual. So just to be safe, I say we put him down. He could break that ankle again. He could break the other ankle. Or he could just bitch a lot. Hmm. I think we're just going to take him home. All right. Well, that is your choice. Yes. Oh, there's one more thing. The results of that blood work came back, and they're very odd. So I'm just going to have it retested. Will not take long. I promise I'm going to get you out of here well before sunrise. Now I'm thinking they're going to test him again? What if they find that Van Helsing muck in his blood? I'm going to have to get him out of here. Get him off. You need to calm down. What the hell? We have a little two-faced bitch lying behind the back vampire in the house, and my husband doesn't think I need to know about it. Cool it, my darling. I'm just trying to find a cure. All right? Now, if I can stop the transformation, maybe Nandor can turn Gizmo. You are a worthless piece of big wet skada, Guillermo. Yeah. When Nandor finds out, he's going to kill you, and then he's going to kill all of us, mm. and then he's going to kill himself. Then don't tell him. I'm not going to lie to my housemate to cover up your treachery. But just give me a chance to make this up. When I did this, I did... <clears throat> well, well, well. You've been gone all night. What, you can't even call? Sorry. They tried to put me down. What? Why? What did the doctor say? Uh, uh, uh. <sighs> yes? Guillermo is fine. Just your average weak-boned, broken foot familiar. <sighs> I guess someone won't be cutting a rug anytime soon. Wait. Don't move. What the hell is this? Hmm? Frog? Really? A frog. A frog that flies and has hair and looks kind of like you. Yeah, Mo, do you think I am an idiot? Say no. No? That's right. Because this is precisely what happens when a little birdie sneaks into this house, fucks a mouse, they have a child that grows up that then fucks a frog that looks like you. <sighs> this is a direct result of your slacking. We are not running a fucking circus here. <laughs> Give him to me. You may have... These are words for money in America. So, I have been teaching and assimilating to America, such as language proficiency. Oh. Way I'm walking here, learn about a thriving etiquette, you piece of shit. I just spilled my coffee. Write it down. Typical American oh. industries. Films, newspapers, beef. Write it down. That's to the colonial patriot hymn, which is the song of the nation. Burgers and fries, Mickey Mouse, Mount Rushmore. Yeehaw! Also, a very important day, which is the annual turkey sacrifice. OK, so welcome to Thanksgiving. When we are not eating, we are paying respects to the bird. Touching it, blowing it, kisses, keeping very low. On three, one, two, three. And then acknowledge the onion. It all started when the guide discovered a new knife. Ja osus e capsis ta excellent. you've burned, you must atone. And that's when I figured it out. One school that everyone went to. School wasn't easy for anyone, but especially not me. All the other children said I was too noisy, so I was always made to sit outside. And then one day, somebody burned down the school. And that person was me. Nobody died, but no one ever learned anything ever again. My fellow villagers never forgave me. 
which is why I believe doing a school for my fellow little anti-Paxons will maybe be a way to reverse this motherfucking hex. In conclusion, the two steps to creating a bank account are one, go to bank, two, open account. Write that down. And to come with me on the first day because I didn't want the class to look too empty. But now I cannot get those two tits to leave. How was your weekend? Same old, same old. I hear that, asshole. No, water cooler does not talk. Write that down. Oh, I'm starting to think that maybe I'm not very good at this. <laughs> Actually going to help me lift this fucking hex. You are struggling. Oh, fantastic. Another disgruntled student. You have a troubled energy about you. Do you know about Nefe? It's like a hex, if you will. <sighs> Crispy old wizened crone. He oh, just, he just Helen. Help me rid myself of this disgusting hex. I, I can't am say the... Hey, I think I have gotten this. Magic can be a very strange and confusing thing, which is why I do not fuck with it. A snake's nose this can fix me, then hell yes, I'm all in. Is there anything else you require for this magic potion? I will need an eye of newt. What is this, a, an enchanted forest or something? Oh. <laughs> they sell what in these modern times? A donut, a donut. Normally I... Oh, I'll get up with this. Goodbye, Hex. One monkey paw. Oh, OK, so we're going straight for the donut. Vanilla glaze with rainbow sprinkles. Magic potion has to be chocolate or yeah. do you mean a cauldron? That is the word. You're going to have to go back out. Of course, yes. And why don't you also grab me? Do you think you might want more sort of witchy, spooky stuff? Bed. I don't know much about hexes or how to get rid of them, obviously. I'm pretty sure I saw her go outside and pick up a stick from the ground. It was a, a crueler. 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 On Forest and Broadway, I said it must be. How can you even tell? I will need a dozen more. Are you kidding me? What do you need, lady? Oh, oh magic woman, what is happening? Oh, it grows more power. Oh, oh no. You must fetch me one last thing. Yes, yes, anything. A dozen powdered munchkins. <laughs> I will get you a dozen powdered munchkins! Stay with me, Helen! What are you doing? Come on! A hex is killing my friend. Okie dokie. I thought her name was Helen the Magic Woman. Hyperaxinol. Something here stinks of a snake's shit. Your name is Helen the Magic Woman. I... The hex is playing tricks on you. <laughs> I do know what it is like to be driven from the only place you have ever called home, just as I was driven out of my village. It ain't great. <laughs> my hex may not have been lifted, but with a little hypnosis, at least Helen's has been. You do not need to be sad anymore. Darling, are you okay? Something is wrong with Laszlo. It has been like this for a few weeks now. Laszlo is so worried about this hex that is ruining my eternal life that he is emotionally depleted. Sadly, I think it's actually, I keep having these dreams where... That is actually because that did happen, Colin Robinson. I think we stop. I mean, we are down to like only 16 fucks a week. We are down to just three. I can't even get enough of a rise out of him. The main Ooh, unit itself. I have been hammering so one, Jimbo, hard you, you on this there. big nail. Yeah, no, Ooh. I'd love to go on oh, home. Sure. Let's pound some rivets, Look baby. What I found. Yes, yes, very good. Thank you. Remember, there are no stupid ideas. You spend a lot of your life being very miserable and sad. Do you have any ideas? Right? Where we all give. Hold on! I've got one! Yeah. Nope, lost it. <sighs> what if what mm -hmm. if we no peeking, cheeky. Dio, Priya. Ladies, all the people that love. And then when we saw the empty chair, many last. Sean is here. Sean. Nas is here this evening. No splendor. The only. Let's look Quaven. Just getting started. It is your rose. A one, a two, a one, two, three, four. If you think missionary position involves lying on top of a missionary, you might be a Laszlo 
Cravensworth. <laughs> if the first thing you look for in a woman is your dick, you might just be a little Cravensworth. <laughs> you think ejaculating onto the pillow counts as cooking your wife dinner, <laughs> you might just be a little Cravensworth. Chuckling at jokes? <laughs> what is this shit? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Peter, just hasn't been himself lately. Vampires! We sit and we brood for centuries on end, plotting the demise of our foes and innocent... Okay, okay I guess we didn't... Roof? Oh. Who, in fact, tried... Let us give you the very simple explanation! Yeah, are, are you okay? Uh, <coughs> yes! Baron, stop! It was just a, a mix-up! Oh, it's easy! Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Film this. Fucking cave. It was Germo who burnt him to a crate. That's on me. Which means we would all die. Maybe it wouldn't be such a bad thing if we ended up dying. Uh, are you okay? Yeah, I've just been going through a lot lately. If you want to live, then yes, I do have a plan. No, no sign of Gizmo or the Baron. Wait, hang on. Hey! You got Germo? No! The Baron! I think he's injured. We had quite the scuffle in there. Oh. They are trying to kill me. Not the Baron. He might forgive. I want to help you, but you have to promise not to hurt me. Yes, I promise. Okay, then. Oh. You're, you're going to be... <laughs> <laughs> All right, dudes. Yoo-hoo! Baron! We've got the little motherfucker, Baron! And now, the show game. <sighs> what is the meaning of this? Sorry. <laughs> Guillermo, this is dangerous territory. Arr. Oh, it was that imp and I would appreciate it. Well, go to here. To Guillermo. <sighs> well, things were almost okay, but now, nit simich. <laughs> as soon as the sun sets and mm. the Baron is awoken, he is very much, well, shut up. Guillermo. Yeah. Yeah, Oh. But on the bright side, he was just a familiar. It was not just a familiar. Okay, yes, yes, it is all very sad, but I think we should now get him in the ground before he starts to stink. Laszlo, can you come and help carry this, please? What are you doing? What are you doing? Laszlo, I do not think we need to eat him. Oh. <laughs> you mean lungs? I mean gills, so he can breathe underwater. That maybe. He never said, uh, I never asked. Who are eyes look like that, my darling? Now you know what you and how you've gone soft. No. A hellhound, but... Together, you know, it can... Kind of. To be honest, I can't really keep track of whatever the fuck is going on around here. So there's that. I just wish you would talk to me, Laszlo. Yes, yes. Is it something I've done? Been cursed with that hangs all around me. Made me in your eyes like an uggo or something. Oh, yeah. What's it? Despite the f alphabetically. But you've been sat here for three weeks. I thought. I mean no! <laughs> this guy! <laughs> mm, sort of hard to shuffle things around at this late stage, but let us. Perdita Morrigan. Company for a week. <gasps> Morrigan Grana, my love! <laughs> is the grand dame. Very quietly. And then blamed it on the cold weather. I have been. <laughs> Means you're doing it right. <laughs> <laughs> Any room in the car. Yeah. I think you brought the paintings. Oh. I figured if you all could connect for this weekend. That's us. Uh, welcome to Morgan Manor. I beg you, please excuse me, oh. but I won't be joining you this weekend. Good games room, a treacherous place. You must all watch out for one another and take care of individuals Six. who only look out for themselves. Yeah. So, good luck. Her extremely busy social schedule. Don't worry about it later. Has anyone seen Laszlo? I can't find him anywhere. And it's really not like him. Oh, Laszlo's missing, eh? Yeah. So like my darling perverted husband to sniff out the local bordello. <laughs> Could you take me to the Belfry? Would you like to take in? Uh, you know, I saw some art last year, so I'm good. Well, this is the Belfry, and where there's... Yes, that is so like my Laszlo. Laszlo's so lucky to have someone like you, someone who cares about him and worries about his well-being. Well, yes, Laszlo is not just my husband or my number one fuck buddy, but he's also my best friend. Here I come! <laughs> oh! To keep you...
be safe. Quickly! Someone or something has imprisoned all of us. No, you fucking donut. <laughs> See he? <laughs> hey! Despicable torture that you have concocted. Well, I like to... to put you up to this. <laughs> uh, <gasps> could be a treacherous place. It said a lot of nice things for you. I... You're just asking us to have a short conversation about your feelings. OK, I think you taught them a lot. My lesson has but only begun. You will eat. Do you really like us? I do. Instead, you treated... You know, I'm starting to think that this might be all of my fault. I've been cursed with... Oh, I have good news. Huh? They're never... <gasps> I just made you... Which did not have... Hi! So that you would, I don't know, see me as a friend. I did say thank you for your help with the hex. Not once. I meant to. Thank you so much. Oh, like! Oh! And you. No one told... That even after all this time of waiting to be... I, I like this cage. There's something going on and everyone knows what it is. Oh, Kay, shit. That's what's going on. She has some very interesting things to say. Uh, He's not wrong. Don't make mistakes. Don't yeah. let, let me out now. And, you know, she also has such great style, all those blacks and greys. Uh, I'm a couple and I eventually move out and leave... Up, bitch. What the hell are you doing here? Did anyone see you? Get inside. No, and it wouldn't matter if they did because, hello, I'm in disguise. Stop dancing. Get inside. How did you find me? I paid him a little visit earlier today, see? <laughs> Who did you think it was? Can you do that? Can do, can do. Thank yeah. you, buddy. Idiot. Guillermo, sit. We cannot talk to the vampire who turned that is a sacred relationship. Like we protect the Baron and the Sire. And the effects for you, my friend, would be catastrophic. I'm sorry. I sure not spoken to Nando trying to kill you thing. Awkward. And, uh, yeah, uh, a little. Yeah. 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 Nando, come on. Yeah, like if you wrote him a suicide note and actually followed through on it, then that would probably cool him down. Wow. They're really going at it, aren't they? Relationships evolve, like me and those anti Paxson people who work at the dance. I was just using them to get rid of my hex. But then it turned out, I really like hanging out with those guys. <clears throat> I know you didn't mean for things to turn out to accept. Do you know what? Hang on, I cannot take this anymore. I no longer blame what? When once we were four. Gizmo was going to stay with us. I would have just said kill him and be done with it. Wait. Drink, bitch. Yeah, drink it. Ah. Ah. I've... Ah, I'm a vamp! Yes, yes, we've all been there. What? Oh, you're sick. Hey, everyone. I'm sorry, what, what's position two? Just as...